एवरीवन वेलकम यू ऑल टू इमेजिनेशन गैलरी हियर वी ट्राई टू शो यू डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ ड्राइंग्स एंड स्टोरीज बिहाइंड इट सो इफ यू आर एन आर्ट लवर एंड वांट्स टू नो द अननोन फैक्ट्स प्रेस द सब्सक्राइब बटन नाउ नाउ लेट मी इंट्रोड्यूस यू टू टुडेस टॉपिक टुडे इन आवर वर्ल्ड टूर सीरीज वी विल टेक आवर पेंटिंग जर्नी टू द कंट्री known as the emerald of the equator it's indonesia so to see this beautiful drawing and to know the stories about it you must watch our video till the end it's indonesian market scene painting friends our world tour series you know always have been very diverse and exciting since starting we crafted so many paintings of different countries around the world and this quest is continuing and today our drawing journey steps to this beautiful and unique land that is located between two continents the continents of asia and australia it is also located between two oceans the indian and the pacific ocean yes it's indonesia We will try to craft a very simple yet lovely painting of Indonesian market scene here. Let's start the endeavor. Friends, as we have already know now that we will craft a market scenery painting of Indonesia today. Here are few simple details have been taken care of today like the attires the color of dresses authentic authenticity etc there is no much chaos have been engaged here with the backgrounds and i have kind of tried my best to emphasis on the figures and the details of a market you know how it looks like over there like you will see there is a lady selling fish and beside her there another lady with the vegetables so here's what my imagination took over the place like you will not certainly see vegetable vendors and fish fish vendors side by side there but i wanted to create kind of that scene like two places into one two market scene into one well this simple painting is what my dedication to those hard working people Uh, friends first is first you know indonesian art carving and painting are among the best known of indonesia's visual art traditions bali long has been a special interest culturally indonesia has a particularly rich tradition of hindu buddhist sculpture and architecture and it was strongly influenced by india from 1st century ce onwards Buddhist art in Indonesia reached its golden era under the Sailendra dynasty of Sri Vijaya Empire between 8th to 13th century. And the art paintings is quite well developed in Bali where its people are famed for their artistry. The Balinese art paintings tradition started as classical Kamasan style visual narrative derived from east javanese visual art discovered on east javanese candy candibas reliefs balinese painting tradition is notable for its highly vigorous yet redefined intricate art which resembles burak folk art with tropical themes ubud and butuan in bali are well known for their paintings Numbers of painter painter artists have settled in Bali which in turn developed the island into world's artists enclave Balinese painting is also sought after collection or souvenir for visitors in Bali My dear friends now about uh, the market scene uh, you know pasar malam they call it pasar malam pasar malam is an indonesian and malay word that literally means night market 
So a pasar malam is a street market in Indonesia, Malaysia, Brunei and Singapore that opens in evening, usually in residential neighborhoods. And there it brings together a collection of stalls that usually sells goods such as snacks, local favorite dishes, fruits, clothes, toys, balloons, watch and alarm clocks and what not. Uh, and everything is at reasonable prices. In Indonesian archipelago, markets are traditionally held on different days with locations rotating among participating villages. Night markets are usually held during special occasion or festival such as uh, Sekaten festival in Java or held in Ramadan nights approximately a week before Lebaran. Indonesia is a country located off the coast of mainland Southeast Asia in the Indian and Pacific Oceans. And friends, it is an archipelago that lies across the equator and spans a distance equivalent to one eighth of Earth's circumference. The capital Jakarta is located near the southwestern coast of Java. The Indonesian archipelago represents one of the most unusual areas in the world. It encompasses a major juncture of Earth's tectonic plates, spans two funnel rings and has for millennia served as a nexus of the peoples and cultural cultures of Oceania and mainland Asia. So, you know, these factors have created a highly diverse environment and society that sometimes seem united only by uh, seismic and volcanic activity, close proximity to the sea and a moist tropical climate. Friends, Indonesia, you know, exhibits a rich diversity of cultural practices and products in cities the maleficious calls to prayers radiating from mosques, many of which display a markedly Muslim architectural style, coexist with the flashing lights and vibrant sounds of urban popular culture. These are just a few examples of Indonesia's truly complex heritage. Borobodur uh, designed a UNESCO World Heritage Site in 1991 is one of the finest Buddhist monuments in the world. Nearly half of Indonesia's population lives in rural areas because volcanoes play a major role there in soil development and enrichment. There is a strong relationship between agricultural development, density of population and location of volcanoes. On Java, the most common settlement is the rural village with its rice paddies that spread across the flatland and in many places it rise up the hillsides in terraces. Scattered throughout the countryside are clusters of coconut, palm and other fruit trees which indicate the location of villages. Each Javanese village has a stream or a well as its source of water, a mosque and an elementary school, and a network of swept earth paths. Goats, chickens, banana and papaya trees and a host of small children are characteristic of village life there. Balinese villages are cluster of walled family complexes with Hindu shrines, public buildings, and a large temples. Scenic mountains, sacred temples, rich culture, sandy beaches, surf-worthy waves, lively nightlife, exciting shopping, the list goes on. It is no surprise that it is known as the Island of Gods. 
Being a large country in size with such diverse culture and covering many time zones, one can find from mysterious Balinese spiritual to the fascinating Komodo dragon. Indonesia is still very much off the radar of travel map except for Bali. Backpackers can enjoy the thrill of exploring the unbeaten tracks. Although, our world tour series will continue. We will continue to search this happiness and joy to share this with you all only. Let this be one family. Let's color and paint the life with Imagination Gallery. Hope you liked and enjoyed today's exploration of Indonesia. Convey your feedbacks and suggestions about our drawing session and do not hesitate to write here in the comment box. So if you like 
our drawing session and you want to know about different paintings and stories behind it then do not forget to subscribe our channel here's wishing you an amazing week stay safe and take care of yourself bye for now